What's up guys, Friendush here. Welcome to a new video. And for today we have some test video about this material. Do you know what this stuff is? Uh, this is a uh, copper popcorn. Here in Serbia we call that a popcorn. Uh, this is uh, basically a uh, molten copper from a motherboard. Some firm from one city here in Serbia do some recycling business and a big, very big furnace. They, they burn and they melt all the boards. So all the boards go in the furnace and on the end you have this. So this is a mix. This copper popcorn is a mix of different metals from the motherboard. I got this little sample uh, for a purpose of testing and this is a 26 gram of copper. Uh, inside of this we have a different metal but maybe contains some gold, maybe contains some palladium, who knows. Because uh, this is from different type of board and uh, maybe if I get lucky I will have some gold from it or platinum or palladium, I don't know. But this is just a test video. So this is 26 gram and right now I will treat that with the nitric acid and every residue which is left, if it left, there will be some noble metal, okay? The guy uh, who sent me this, uh, sent me this just for a test video and uh, he said if I get lucky and uh, if I get some noble metal, it's all mine. So. Okay, let's start. If you see that, the color is very different. Normally it's copper, but you got some other colors on this alloy. I don't worry about the tin in it, because uh, tin on the big heat, tin uh, mostly vapors out from this metal. So I think that uh, just diluted nitric acid will be the uh, right stuff to process that. And uh, no more talk, let's start.
Okay guys, our popcorn is dissolved. If you see on top, I got some metallic particles. I don't know what is this. Maybe it's some platinum or palladium. It's very light. You see that flakes, but amount is too small. And uh, on the bottom, on the bottom we have some deposit, but this is very gray deposit. So just to be sure, what is this? I need to process that with the aqua regia. I don't know, maybe some platinum or palladium, but maybe some other metal, who knows. So right now, I will filter that and process the slug with the aqua regia. Just check that, what is it, okay? This is the filter which I use, it's a normal coffee filter, size 2, it's better when it's size 4 but right now I cannot go to store so I need to use that little one because that stupid virus I cannot go to store and I need to use what I have, okay? So this is just a normal coffee filter for a, for a solution filtering, okay? Okay guys, so you see this, this is the residue, it's not very heavy, but you see that, these metal particles, so this is some kind of metal, maybe, maybe it's some dirtiness, I don't know, but I think it's some kind of metal. So right now I will add just drop aqua regia, dissolve that and check that with a stenius test to see what is it, okay? And guys, this is our solution. Now it's filtered and clean. Now I will drop just a tiny amount of uh, alcoholic acid to check for any silver in solution. And you see that just a little amount, almost invisible amount of silver chloride form. See that? Look at that, all that cloudy shape on the bottom. So let's add just a little more. Yeah. So this popcorn contain some little amount of silver. Definitely. This is a pure nitric acid. So contain some little little small amount of silver. Right now I will let that settle down. But the amount is a uh, not worth for processing. Now I go to check my little aqua regia for platinum and palladium, okay? This is a drop, our solution from dissolved slug. Right now I will drop just one drop of Stenius test. See if there anything. Well, nothing's there. So that is just some other metal, maybe, I don't know, some aluminum or something else. Some metal who's not reactive on a nitric acid, but 
in this pop core no precious metal okay see no color change no nothing pretty disappointing okay so this is our aqua regia and uh, don't contain nothing but just for case this is go to my stock pot and uh, see that still I have a couple of little particles almost a uh, gray color and very light which is not dissolved so maybe this is the some metal but on test not show nothing no palladium no platinum no gold so this 26 gram popcorn don't contain nothing from the precious metal maybe from a kilogram I will get something but right now I will not consider that buy that see that this is some kind of metal but the amount is uh, so so small and so light that I cannot melt that okay right now this go to stock pot and with these our test is finished okay pretty disappointing but show must go on okay okay guys so the result on the end of test is a uh, disappointing but uh, I will not uh, tell for this test that is uh, unsuccessful because I know right now that I will not buy this material definitely with this kind of uh, process uh, for a recovery uh, in the big pile when you burn and melt uh, all the boards uh, probably it's uh, mostly a new boards so uh, if you have a luck to get uh, specifically amount of uh, this popcorn uh, uh, from old board maybe you will uh, have some lucky and uh, you will get some uh, decent amount of uh, noble metal but uh, you never know what you get if I have maybe a kilogram of these copper popcorn maybe I will find inside some noble metal but for now from this 26 gram it's just little trace of uh, silver inside and uh, on the end uh, no gold no palladium no platinum there so uh, for me this is not best material for uh, precious metal recovery okay maybe on the big scale when you have uh, tons of that uh, material maybe you will get something but uh, on this small amount you don't get anything okay so i hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, I will see you in the next video, okay? Friendly out.